Good evening, everybody. It's me, Marcia, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about what a lot of people go through as they age. And I believe everybody will is supposed to lose like two inches in their spine as they get older. Uh, I guess it shrinks. I don't know, but like I say, you're six foot four and you end up six foot two. That's guys. I don't think there's very many women that tall, but there might be. Or if you're five foot nine, you end up five foot seven. Or if you're whatever, you lose like two inches. Some might lose more, but they call that osteoporosis and um, or bone density loss. And that's what I'm going to talk to you about today. And there's oils that can help with some of that. Uh, I will read, and hopefully I can get through it without too many difficulty of words. And that you can learn something from it like I am. So let's get started. Um, I hope you can see okay. It says osteoporosis is primarily caused by six main factors. <laughs> Progest progesterone deficiency. Oh boy. Like I said, there's going to be some hard words in here. Estradiol extra growth deficiency, testosterone deficiency, lack of magnesium or boron, boron in your diet, lack of vitamin D in your diet, lack of dietary and oral calcium, natural pro pro progesterone, progesterone is the single most effective way to increase bone density in women over the age of 40. Clinically studies uh, by John L. I mean John Lee, uh, MD, showed dramatic increases in bone density using just 20 milligrams of daily topically applied progesterone. progesterone. Calcium, magnesium, and boron, B-O-R-O-N, are a few of the most important minerals for bone health and for using lacking of deficient in most modern diets. Magnesium is especially important for bone strength, but most Americans consume only only a fraction of the two, of the 400 milligrams daily of value needed for bone health. Calcium and magnesium may not be adequately metabolized when consumed be, be, because of poor intestinal flora or excess phytates in a diet, a, program, a problem with vegetarians. Phytates uh, occur in many nuts grains and seeds including rice enzymes like phytate trace are essential for increasing calcium absorption by by liberating calcium from insoluble phytate complex complexes lack of vitamin d which here comes a word i can't pronounce i'm gonna try uh, choli calcifero choli choli calcifero c h o l e c a l c i f e r o l if you want to look it up it's for vitamin d um has become epidemic um, among older people and has continued to the lack of absorption of calcium in the diet. Megacal, alkaline, which I showed you alkaline yesterday, the megacal, alkaline, and mineral essence are all excellent sources of calcium and magnesium, which are essential for strong bones. Mineral essence is an excellent source of magnesium and other trace minerals. Avoid drinking anything that is carbonated, 
because it can leach calcium from the bones and I did not know that and I drink Mountain Dew and once in a while I slip a monster in there and I shouldn't drink those things they're carbonated and they're not good for you they taste good but they're not good for you anyway avoid drinking anything that is carbonated because it can leach calcium from the bones due to phosphoric acid content studies show that the majority of women who do re resistance training three to four times a week do not develop osteoporosis. I need to start exercising. I really do. Not only for my bones, but for my health. And help me lose weight. I'll look better. I'll feel better. You know? So, what's my excuse? Laziness. Honest to God, it's my laziness. Get off my duff. Or, you can't get anything that done sitting on Grandma's couch. Right? Anyway, some oils that will help with, with the bone dis density loss is wintergreen, Idaho balsam fir, palo santo, sacred frankincense, regular frankincense, frankincense vitality, thyme, thyme vitality, cypress, peppermint, peppermint vitality, marjoram, marjoram vitality. I didn't know marjoram was a vitality, so I learned something today. Marjoram is really good for pain in, in your muscles. I like putting it on my knees. Uh, rosemary, rosemary vitality, basil, basil vitality, elemony, or E L E M I, I might not pronounce it right, and L E M E, northern lights, black spruce, and pine. And some blends. Now, those are all singles. Each one I just mentioned, that's the only thing that's in the bottle. Just that one product. Now the blends is more than one oil mixed together. So you might have singles inside the blends to make a blend. And there's like scolorescence, which I love scolorescence. I'll talk to you about that tomorrow. The scolorescence, and it has scolorescence vitality, panaway, aroma seas, purification, milrose, sacred mountain, and relieve it. Those are all the blends. And then the nutritionals is Estro, Femigium, um, Indo, Indogize, BLM, Algize, Megacal, Estensulzyme, Detoxime, Alkaline, Mineral Essence, um, S essential enzymes four, supercal, sulfurzyme, thyromine, and pyrogyze. And for body care to rub on the skin, I suppose body care is uh, prenolone, prenolone, p r e n o l o n e, prenolone. Uh, plus body cream and progression plus and that's what it says um, I don't know how many people watching this video uh, has it, this problem or is in the verge of doing this the what it takes to keep from getting this problem or if they know somebody who has this problem already the osteoporosis bone density loss. Um, share this with those who you do know who does, who who you want to help, and, uh, and and take care of yourself if you're getting that way as well. I know I need to. So I hope you enjoyed this. And tomorrow, like I said, I will be talking to you about sclerosis. So I see you tomorrow. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your evening. Ta-ta.